All right, that's right. Well, happy Earth Day and no better way to celebrate Earth Day than to plant trees. We are with uh, the folks at Casey Trees this morning where volunteers are going to convene and there's about 40 of them that are going to plant 25 trees. So we're going to stick around all morning and see what a difference Casey Trees makes right here in the DMV. Hey, good morning to you. We are at uh, UDC campus this morning. It's all about restoring, enhancing and protecting the tree canopy in the nation's capital. That's the job of uh, Casey Trees. Uh, this is Italia. She's director of communications. You guys have uh, been in the area over 20 years, but I want to make sure everybody at home understands what you guys do. Yeah, absolutely. So our mission here is to restore, enhance and protect the tree canopy of our nation's capital. So um, a lot of people think it's just tree planting, but it's really more than that from education to mapping, research, policy. Um, we've been doing it all for almost two decades now. And, you know, it takes more than just putting trees in the ground to protect um, what we have here and hopefully get to our 40% tree canopy goal. So 40% is the tree canopy goal. So does that mean, what, how, what does that mean to the lay person? It means we just have more trees in the DMV? Yeah, so if you think about it from a top-down analysis, um, you can see like uh, the percentage of uh, you know, canopy cover. So what is, you know, road versus a tree? And, you know, when we say we want to hit 40%, um, it's literally saying that 40% from a top down aerial perspective is covered by canopy. Awesome. And it makes it beautiful and it's green. And you guys uh, here on the UDC campus today, you have an event. How many volunteers are you expecting and how many trees are going to go in the ground? Yeah, so today we have 40 people coming out to plant around uh, 25 trees um, and there's a bunch of students, different community groups. Um, we really like to engage the people that are going to be around these trees protecting and, you know, taking care of taking care of them. You know, we have a hot summer coming up and we want to make sure that they'll be cared for. So really getting the investment from the day one that they go on the ground. And the neat thing is, I mean, as we uh, look around, you can see that uh, things are already set up and it's probably going to be two people uh, to a tree. How long are you guys anticipating being out here today? So depending on the soil really is kind of, that's the, the game of it here. So if it's a, it looks like it's going to be really nice soil, probably around an hour and a half, two hours, and then we're going to have some lunch, celebrate. Um, they have, uh, you know, an Earth Day uh, celebration going on at the campus here today. So we'll probably get to go enjoy that as well. It's awesome. And I can't think of a better way to celebrate Earth Day than planting a tree. So coming up, we're going to speak to an arborist. We're also going to plant a tree and just kind of see, you know, what we know, and what we don't know about tree planting. We're back with more right after this. Yeah, well, I'm definitely uh, watching other people do the part, but man, I am thrilled to share it with you guys this morning. So we're on the campus of a UDC. We have a KC Trees, and this morning they're planting 25 trees. You see now they've got the uh, team leaders. They're ready over there. That's right, wave guys. So they're going to be uh, helping organize 25 or 40 rather volunteers. So we've got the volunteer coordinator this morning, Chelsea. Uh, things are going to start getting busy as people are checking in. How many volunteers are you expected this morning? Yeah, we're expecting around 40 to 50 volunteers to come out today. Um, excited for Earth Day. Yeah, it, no, it's awesome. It's like happy Earth Day, right? <laughs> yes. So for the people who are volunteering, uh, so you guys have some gear for them? Like, what do they need to get started? Yeah, so they will wear a yellow safety vest, some gloves, just to make sure that they are protected through this process. And then they'll get shovels and pickaxes and really get out there and start digging some holes. Well, and you know, when you say digging some holes, we've got about, what, I think, 25 trees and a big variety of trees. Yeah, we like to plant a diverse group of trees just so we make sure, you know, if one thing happens to one of the species of trees, you'll still have a bunch of trees left here at the end of, you know, end of the season. The, the end of the season. And that's right, you guys can see it's really just going to run uh, from one end of the street uh, to the other. Lots of volunteers, people are getting excited, they're getting set up. I know you guys typically do these plants on the weekends, obviously made an exception today. Yeah, we do some Fridays and then Earth Day is a very special day to us. So we want to make sure we're out here. We're also having an event on Arbor Day on Friday. So we'll do a couple of weekday events, but every Saturday we'll be planting trees. I love it. And people need to go online and sign up, register to volunteer. Yep, just at caseytrees.org. You can go click on the volunteer tab and come out anytime. Awesome. They, these guys do great work. If you want to be a part of it, again, check out their website. Uh, but hey, we are all morning here at UDC planting trees. Coming up, we're on the campus of UDC. We are celebrating Earth Day by planting 25 trees. The goal, though, this year, over 3,000. We're with Casey Trees, live right after this.
Welcome back to Great Day Washington. This morning we are celebrating Earth Day by joining the folks of uh, Casey Trees as they are planning at a UDC campus. But you know, uh, Maddie here, she is an arborist. Maddie McPhee, this is something you guys do all the time. Mm -hmm. How many trees did you plant last year and what, what's your goal this year? So we're looking to plant 2,000 trees um, and we plant in the fall and in the spring so right now we're kicking it off in the spring the trees are blooming which is great so it makes a nice little atmosphere and hopefully it doesn't get too hot throughout the season. And you guys uh, have a variety of trees out here today but where do your trees come from? A majority of our trees are coming from Berryville, Virginia our farm Casey Trees Farm. Nice. Mm -hmm. And then uh, today we've got a number of volunteers coming out. They're participating. And for folks at home that are checking this out right now, what you'll see is that we see a pink flag. We see those by every tree. What, what do those uh, indicate? Yeah, so we work with different partners across the city. This particular planting, we're working with UDC. So we figure out what kind of trees they want, what they're looking, what their goals are. And then we design a planting plan based on their their goals. So right now we're trying to plant a lot of canopy trees, understory trees as well. Well, Matt, what a pleasure. Thank you Thank so you. much. We're going to send it back to Marquette, who's in the studio, and I think I better get a shovel and get to work. <laughs>